Alrighty, happy holidays. So I'm gonna show you one more uh, video on uh, how to make a delicious espresso martini. Okay, this is gonna be really good. So if instead of dessert, you don't want something heavy and you just want a little, little coffee pick me up and a little um, after dinner cocktail, this will be a good one. So I always make coffee and then I put it in the fridge because I like iced coffee. So this is just cold coffee right now, but if you wanna do um, espresso and then let that cool, that'll work out great too, because of course you don't ever wanna add hot liquids to a cocktail that you're gonna chill. Okay, so first I'm gonna get a little bit of ice. Okay, I've got my ice in my little shaker, um, shaker thing. I have a nice clear glass because of course it's gonna be an espresso martini so we kind of want to see it um, see it through. And I don't know what happened to my other two cocktails but apparently Randy took them. Anyway, so uh, this time, you know, we can just, we can just do whatever we want. So I've, I happen to have caramel vodka, which that might be delicious. Let's see what it smells like. Ooh, that smells delightful. Okay, so I'll put a little bit of that in there. I think I'm gonna use three liquors, so I don't necessarily need to use a full shot. So maybe a half shot. And then this one is chocolate vodka. I have a couple different ones of these and I never use them. Oh, good Lord. Ooh, that smells good. Okay, so we'll use a little bit of that. And then we're gonna use Kahlua, which of course, you know, coffee liqueur, you always have to use Kahlua because that's classic, about a third of a shot of that, or you know, whatever, two thirds of a shot. And then we're gonna add my cold coffee or cold espresso if you want it stronger. So add a bit of that. This gives you a nice little pick me up. Ugh. And then a little bit of half and half, because of course we want it to be creamy dreamy. All right, and now we're gonna shake it with our ice because we want a nice cold cocktail. So this will be a great after dinner cocktail for your holiday parties. You want a nice, pretty, clear martini glass so that it shows because you have the nice cream in it. So by shaking it like this, we're gonna make it nice and frothy on top, okay? So now, we're, oh goodness, we're going to pour. See how it comes out kind of frothy? You get that little, that little head on the top. Oh my gosh, look at how perfect that is. See how easy it is to make drinks? Stop being afraid. It's, there's nothing to be afraid of. It's so freaking easy, it's ridiculous. Okay, here I have a bunch of shaved hunk of chocolate that I just kind of shaved up. Shake it over the top. Oh my gosh, doesn't that look delightful? Caramel vodka, chocolate vodka, and Kahlua. What could possibly go wrong? Stop it. Oh crap, my, 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 my pots and pans are hanging. Oh my God, that's so delicious, I can't even believe it. Okay, that's a winner, and it's gonna keep me awake to make dinner, so that's a good thing. Mmm, yummy, yummy. Mmm. Try this one, it's fantastic. Just make sure that you make your coffee or espresso ahead of time so it has time to chill. Happy holidays, happy Hanukkah, Hanukkah, happy Kwanzaa, whatever you celebrate, I don't care, I love you all. Hope to see you all on the dance floor. Happy New Year.